It's all about getting kids involved in art and giving back to the community, especially given that there isn't a whole lot of funding for these types of art projects. And I mean, it's also the opportunity for kids to show off their creativity. Shake. <laughs> And spray. Um, as far as what we're our, our basic outreach is, is creativity. You know, uh, it's an open open canvas, man. I mean, there's there's no wrong way to do an art, is the way I see it. Artworks Midland wanted to get the youth in the community involved, and their involvement is about to be on big display at Pool Techniques Incorporated in Midland. We are kicking off our youth art project, the uh, Artworks Midland Youth Art Project. Um, it's our one of our very first uh, community murals that we are doing with the city, uh, trying to bring some kids out and just get them involved in artwork and stuff. The group partnered with Teen Flow, a youth ministry group, to start the project. And we like to get them also out of the house, get them somewhere that they can um, kind of pour into something positive and have fun with it, have fun with their peers, experience new things in the community. And the turnout was huge. It's an opportunity because, you know, a lot of people can't come here and because of COVID, but it's, it's fun. It's appreciated. And I said all my servant leaders to come and support us and just have fun, you know? The kids are not the only ones getting something out of the mural. Local businesses are donating walls to bring more color to Tall City. I actually had a friend reach out to me on Facebook that showed me what was going on, and we had actually recently painted our building, and we just thought it'd be a great addition to it and to spread positive vibes down in downtown Midland because we really don't have much color down here. Artworks Midland hopes that this is the first of many projects throughout the city. They plan on working with several different organizations. And the love that you see on this mural right behind me, Artworks Midland says that the message is simple. Everyone could use a little bit of love right now. Reporting in Midland, Jonathan Palasik, News West 9.